Okay, time now for the mix. And as we continue our St. Patrick's Day celebration, we found a video that combines some of my favorite things. Beer, chocolate cake, and men with foreign accents. I'm on board with the first two for sure. <laughs> so these guys from a website called sortedfood.com are sharing their recipe for a chocolate Guinness cake. They make it in a Guinness mm. pint cup glass and it, check it out. The method's really simple. Just heat up Guinness and butter in a pan. Throw in the sugar, cocoa and oil and stir until it's nice and smooth. Crack the egg and yogurt into a bowl separately. Mix in the flour, raising agent and the hot chocolate mixture. Couldn't be easier. Couldn't be easier. That looks really make, good, right? And then they make this icing that also has Guinness in it to look like the foam at the top of the beer and cheers. That is so there cool. There you have it. I love have that. To make that. All right, check out these two uh, kids from California. They're in high school. They've come up with a golf trick. It's really awesome. One guy chips the ball, the other guy, take a look. The viral. Trust me, it's hard to like chip a ball. Uh, predictable fashion yeah, for that guy to do that very for him not to get hit instinct. in the back yeah they're really good one more time yeah good stuff that is pretty cool right, i can't got? even hit the ball when it's yes. sitting still so i'm impressed mm -hmm. if you ever wonder what your dog is up to when you leave the house oh i love these things. oh yes this yeah. is a good one especially for people who come home and wonder why their bed or their blankets <laughs> are covered in dog hair this is what happened when a woman left home has the camera running and her pit bull sees the opportunity, kind of scopes things out, wonders why in the heck does the cat get to sit there, but I don't. Mm -hmm. And now check this out. <laughs> yeah, he's not enough to sit on the bed, right? He has exactly. to do that. Kind of, he's got in to roll face, over owner. every corner yeah, of right. the bed, marking it as his territory. Gotta love it. All right. I got so distracted watching the dog, I got a little confused on my own thing. This is very, <laughs> very cute. Check this out. He's four years old, and he's this... The grandson of St. Joe's coach Phil Martelli, who just had a big college basketball win going into March Madness. He was a hit. This is um, his grandson. Check him out. You'll see him. Four years old. See him there, standing there. He's got his suit on, just like uh, Grandpa. He's got his tie. He's got his magic marker. He's got his clipboard. Gigantic fan of the crowd. Okay, my work is done. Oh yeah. Now you got to scream, throw a couple of tantrums. But check out that tie. Isn't that awesome? Ties down to his knees. Yeah. Oh yeah. We know what he's gonna be when he grows up. He looks stressed the whole bit. Yeah, no, he's got it.